Hello, Russell Reed Falcons. Here at the school today on this beautiful day, thought we'd go for a little walk through the school, make sure you guys remember what it all looks like. So here we go. Beautiful day out here, much better than it was earlier on this week. All right, heading up to the front door. here. Well, I think this saying on the wall is very appropriate right now. And I'm over here. Mrs. Kennedy's here. Good morning, everyone. Have a great day, Mrs. Kennedy. Thank you. Alright, let's head down the hallway and see what we can see. Here we are, heading into Miss Burkett's room. Hey, Ms. Burgett, how are you? Good morning, Mr. Ledbetter. Welcome to the grade one classroom. So nice of you to drop by. We've been busy in math, measuring, and then we've been doing some fraction work as well. We've been practicing our words of the week and rhyming words. We even went on a field trip to the San Diego Zoo. We've had some birthdays in our classroom. We've had some kids losing teeth and riding bikes without their training wheels. We've been, a lot has been going on. So uh, thank you very much for dropping by grade one and seeing how we're doing. Take care. Well, you have a great day, Mrs. Burkett. Oh, we'll head on into Mrs. Fuller's room. Hey, Mrs. Fuller. Mr. Ledbetter, it's Mrs. Fuller here. Uh, obviously, we're not in the classroom, but we are doing some really great online learning. We're doing math, spelling, reading. My class is doing fantastic. Just to let you know, though, uh, when I get stressed and overwhelmed, just like everybody else right now, I have to come out in the backyard and jump with my family. <laughs> All right, talk to you soon. Head on down the hallway here to Mrs. Lemon's room. Hi, Mrs. Lemon. Oh, hi, Mr. Ledbetter. Sorry, the kids are in the gym right now with Mrs. Colasar. But um, I can tell you they've been working really hard this past little while. They've been working on learning about frogs and doing some writing. This week they're doing some poetry writing about bugs. 
and they've also been learning their multiplication facts. I'm so proud of them and I hope they can keep it up till the end of the year. Have a great day Mrs. Lemon. I'll look around here for Mrs. Coleman. Hmm. Well maybe I'll check outside. Let's uh, see if I can see her somewhere out there. Good afternoon Mr. Ledbetter. Sorry I snuck out on my lunch to get a little bit of exercise. Wanted to say hi to boys and girls, frustrated family. Wish you all so much. Hope you're getting a break from online learning, getting outside. The weather's going to get warmer. on down to the gym. Let there be light. Hey, it's Mrs. Colazar. I've been practicing my flips. Here you go, Mrs. Cargis. Go. Thanks, Mrs. Colasar. Hi, Mr. Ledbetter. I'm just practicing my basketball for when the kids come back. Thanks, ladies. Looks like you guys have been very active. All right, let's head on out here and let's uh, head on to Mr. Fuss's room. Hey, Mr. Foss. Hey, Mr. Edbetter. How are you? Come on in. Um, Foss is doing really well, as you can see. Uh, they've been working really hard. Um, they've been so quiet. Like, it's been weird. It's almost like they're not even here. Hey, okay, have a great day, Mr. Foss. Head on into Mrs. Loggett's room. How you doing, Mrs. Loggett? Hey, Mr. Ledbetter. How are you doing? Come on in. We're doing some decimal work and we've got such great math thinking going on. You gotta hear it. We'll see you later. Well, we'll head on into Mrs. Raycraft's room. Oh, said it wrong again. Mrs. Eisenbach. I don't know if I'll ever get that right. Well, hello, Mrs. Eisenbach. Oh, hey, Mr. Ledbetter. Thanks for that birthday message. Here we come up to Mrs. Ages' club. 
glass. Hey, Mrs. Ages. Hi, everybody. It's Mrs. Ages here with my boys. Cousin. We hope that you guys are staying safe at home and that you're enjoying your time with your families. I know that we are very busy doing lots of science experiments, arts and crafts, and lots of bike rides and enjoying family time. We do miss school and our regular routine, and we hope that we can get back to all of that soon. In the meantime, keep working hard at your schoolwork fun with your family and stay safe. We'll hopefully see you soon. Take care, Bye. everybody. Bye, everyone. Hey, Ledbetter. How are you? I'm just here hanging out with my fans. Uh, I just wanted to let the students know that um, I'm thinking about them. I'm looking forward to going back to work, going back to school. Uh, if we don't see each other until September, I hope you all have a good summer and uh, go Falcons. Well, have a great day. Uh, keep moving on here. I think we'll head on into the uh, back hallway. So uh, we'll pop into Mrs. Cargus' room, even though I know that she's in the gym. Adele Houtley. Oh, bonjour, Adele. Hi, Mr. Ledbetter. Bonjour tout le monde. Vous me manquez beaucoup et j'ai hâte de vous voir bientôt à l'école. I miss you all very much, and I'm looking forward to seeing you at school soon. Au revoir! Heading into Mr. Gray's room. Outside somewhere. Hey, how you doing? Good to see you. Grade seven these days, we're working on their climate study. They are uh, doing some language, uh, a little bit of math, pulling, uh, you know, making them working hard. We uh, hope everybody's safe at home, staying well, and uh, get outside, nature. It's uh, it'll continuously teach you. Have fun with it. Take good care. Well, let's continue our journey. I think maybe what we'll do is uh, take a little walk uh, outside. See what the playground looks like. So silent out here. Alright, let's go back in. Alright, we'll head on.
head on down here. Let's have a look. We'll see if Mr. Peters is around. Hey, Mr. Peters. Hey everyone, it's Mr. Peters here. And for the past few months, our class has been turning fractions into slices of pizza and math. We've been making structures like pulleys and bridges in science. And we've even been throwing around toilet paper in gym class. Those are just a few of the things that we've been up to in the past few months. Thanks for stopping by. Well, thanks for sharing, Mr. Peters. Head to our computer lab. Hey, look, it's Mr. Little. Hello, Russell Reed students. I hope you have been safe and continue to do online learning. I miss all of you and hope by working together, things will go back to normal. Keep your chin up. I look forward to seeing all of you back to school and to help with all your technology needs. Mr. Little. Oh, and by the way, during this COVID-19 pandemic, I also adopted a baby squirrel. His name is Stanley. Well, Mr. Little, I hope that squirrel doesn't drive you nuts. <laughs> well, let's head on down and have a look and check out the library. Miss Smith hiding back there? Hi, I hope everyone's doing well. I just finished chatting with some of my friends from elementary school and we were able to reminisce and talk about all the fun things that we did and all the memories that we made. So I really hope that you are not thinking that you're missing out on those opportunities, but instead you're taking this opportunity to make different types of memories. FaceTime, write a letter, send an email, do whatever it takes to connect with each other, check in on each other, and make memories that you'll be able to reminisce on. All right, have a great day, Miss Smith. Well, we'll head into our final hallway. into the kindergarten rooms. Hey, it's Mrs. Gatopoulos and Miss Swan. Oh, hi, Mr. Ledbetter. I'm just um, putting some of my herbs while I've been home. I've been doing some gardening in my spare time, and I've been making a space 
ship, my kids. Hi, Mr. Ledbetter. Hi, all my kindergarten friends and all my students at Russell Reed School. Miss um, Swan has her pet Ella today with her. And the one thing Ella has not been enjoying with Miss Swan being home is going for lots of walks through the day. She's not been a fan of that. But Ella has been enjoying seeing a lot more squirrels and we've been seeing a lot of birds outside. And the other day, Miss Swan saw two deer. So that was pretty exciting. So I miss all of you so much. And I'm hoping that I can see you all again really, really soon. Until then, have fun, stay safe, and we'll be together again soon. Bye. See you later, ladies. Head over to the other kindergarten side here. Oh, hey, Mr. Ledbetter, you're just in time for circle time. We are sharing things that make us happy. It's my turn, thank you. What makes me happy? Sunshine, baseball, the beach, animals, I especially love dogs, my family, and my friends. I'm really missing my friends at Russell Reed School right now. I hope you're all keeping healthy and safe and happy at home and looking forward to sunshine ahead. I'm sure it's just around the corner. Now it's your turn to tell us what makes you happy. Hey, my turn to talk. Thank you. Question is, what makes me happy? There are lots of things that make me happy, but if I had to narrow them down to some of my favorite, I would have to say yellow flowers, the sound of children laughing, nothing better than hearing kids giggle, bright warm sunshine, hot cup of tea, hugs, smiles, the love of my family, and being kind. Especially right now, it's great to see people doing and saying kind things for one another. And the thing that makes me really happy is teaching. And I know right now we're doing things differently, but we're gonna be together soon, and that makes me really happy. Now it's your turn. What makes you happy? Hi boys and girls, I really miss you. Oh, wait a minute. My dog just passed me the ball, so I guess it's my turn to talk. What makes me happy? Children's laughter, being kind, hugs, dancing, baking, and gardening. What makes you happy? I'll pass you the ball. All right, thanks ladies. See Mrs. Stadnicki's. Mrs. Dad, Nikki, and Mrs. Stevens, what are you up to? You caught me! Oh no! I'm eating in class. Get out my mouth, Mrs. Stevens. Ah, you know these are our favorite. We miss you guys. 
You never know what teachers get up to when students are not in the room. Well, let's head on out here. Oh, here is uh, someone down the hallway. Hi, Mr. Ledbetter. Oh, look it. Look who's at the water fountain for the third time today. Maybe you should be heading back to class. But just remember, have a great day. Well, we'll see you later, Ms. Fitzpatrick. Well, everyone, that brings us to the end of our tour. Just going to head back out and close up the school. We'll turn off the lights. Head back outside. I hope you guys enjoyed the tour as much as I did. I look forward to the days when we can all get back together. We miss you. Be safe, be healthy, and we'll see you soon.